Well, actually, this one is periwinkle. It's already uh, full. Okay, cooked. first we boil the uh, periwinkle uh, enough for it to clean before we chop it up. Okay, so we chopped it into little pieces so that <clears throat> the sauce can penetrate the meat better. So it's a sauce. Okay, the meat special meat. ingredient is dry star anise. And this anise one meat. is the licorice uh, powder. So seminum powder. That's very important. Some basil, sugar, some cinnamon powder, and some red wine, olive oil, and butter, and garlic. Uh, That's the most important. Olive oil. I'm going to put it in here. Okay. And then I'm going to put butter. Okay, so if you have time, you can chop the uh, fresh garlic. But I use the uh, minced garlic already made. So just simmering it. And we put in the um, powder. So I'll put some of these. And stir it up. We need to put some salt, some cinnamon powder, and brown sugar. So brown sugar and salt. Okay. Now we'll put some wine and, and mix it up. Balsamic vinegar. Taste it first and see if it's good. Wow, it's perfect. Now we can put the okay. uh, wink some cinnamon powder, a little bit. So, we're going to simmer in this one. So the longer you simmer the thing the more it will soak the sauce that is so good the important thing is that these nails and stuff like that they have their own smell so we need to simmer it long and all of these spices will kill all of the smell and it's going to taste so good because the wine the spice, the sugar, the salt it's going to make it taste oh, simmering and we just turn it off make sure we cut some um, basil now it's going to smell so good